بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم Welcome to my YouTube channel Calculus and Mathematics Learning In the previous video we finished and eliminated with exercise number 7.4 related with chapter number 7 Trigonometric class and Mathematics In today's video I am going to solve exercise number 7.2 question number 1 This exercise is very important for both of bar, bar, in case of both point of view At least one question must come from this exercise in board paper like KPK board, Sain board or other board of Pakistan so it means that this exercise is very important. So let's move toward question number one of this exercise number 7.2, chapter 7, trigonometry. Find the value of L when theta is pi by 6 radian and the value of radius R is 2 cm. Let's suppose this is a circle. This is the center of this circle and let's suppose this is the radius of this circle. And let's suppose this is the circumference. This is actually the circumference. Any point on the circle is circumference. So the distance from the circumference to the center is let's suppose this is uh, S R actually we can also tell the let's suppose this is uh, L length L and the angle subtend over here by this circle is let's suppose theta. So according to the geometry or theorem L will be equal to the product of these two quantities radius and uh, theta. So using this formula we will uh, solve this exercise number 7.2. So move to the part number one solution. Using the formula L is equal to R theta, so L will be equal to R putting the values R is 2 cm into theta. Theta is pi by 6 radian. Pi by 6 radian. Now, for power simplification, it become 2 cm into pi by 6 can be written as pi. 6 can be written as 3 multiplied 2. So, 2 cancel out with 2. We are left with L is equal to pi divided by 3 cm. Now the value of pi is 22 over 7, so put it, so 22 over 7, 7 multiply 3. Because 7 is in division, so it multiply with 3, so it will give us 22 divided by 7 multiply 3 gives us 21 centimeter. This is actually the required and desired length of this circle. You can also find the exact value by dividing 22 over 21 uh, with calculator. Now move to the next part of part number 2. Part number 2, theta is equal to 30 degree and r is equal to 6 centimeter. Find the value of a. Remember that theta must be an uh, radian according to the uh, circular system and, and you know that degree is actually is an sexa, sexagesimal system we will convert into the circular system in circular system the value of uh, the unit of theta is actually the radian so you know that uh, phi radian is equal to 180 degree divide with 180 both side so on this side we are left with 1 degree is equal to and on this side we are left with pi radian divided by 180. Now over here we have 30 degrees so multiply 30 to the both sides. So 30 degree will be 35 divided by 180 radian. Now 0 cancel out with 0 we are left with 30 degrees is equal to 35 divided by 18 can be written as 6 multiply 3 radian. So 3 cancel out with 3 so the value of 30 degrees pi divided by 6 radian. So this is the conver conversion form. Now using the formula L is equal to R theta. So the value of L will be R is actually 6 cm multiplying theta. Theta we convert 30 degree to pi by 6. So the theta will be 5 by 6 radian. Now what are this? By further simplification 6 multiply 5 will use a 6 pi and divided by 6. So you know that L is actually the distance. So its unit will be centimeter. 6 cancel out with 6. So we are left with L is equal to pi centimeter. Now you know that pi is actually 3.14 and goes on. So 3.1 centimeter is actually the length of, of this, uh, this, this distance from the, from the center of this circle to the circumference. So this is actually 3.14 centimeter. Now move to the third part of theta is equal to 4 pi radian divided by 6 and the value of radius r is equal to 6 centimeter. Mm -hmm. Now again using the formula L is equal to r theta. So it becomes L will be equal to r. r is 6 centimeter into theta. Theta is actually given in the radian so we cannot convert it into radian because it is actually in the radian. So 4 pi by 6 radian. Now by further simplification this 6 is in multiplication. And this 6 is in division, so they will cancel out with each other. We are left with L is equal to 4 pi centimeter because the value of uh, the unit of L is actually centimeter. So by further simplification, the value of pi is actually 22 divided by 7 in the fraction form. You know that uh, 
4 multiply 22 multiply 4 will give us the value L is equal to 22 multiply 2 multiply 4 gives us 8 and 2 multiply 4 gives us 8. So 88 divided by 7 centimeter is actually the required and desired length of this circumference to the center. This is actually the length which is actually 88 divided by 7. You can also calculate the exact value by dividing 18 and 7 by each other in calculator. So with this question I finish my lecture, thank you for watching, subscribe my channel and also hit the bell icon to receive the upcoming notification about class 10 mathematics, thank you.